All right, well, what we're going to do now is <clears throat> hook this outlet up. And uh, then we're going to put it in this box here. So this is kind of an old one. I hope it works. First of all, I bent this uh, wire in the right direction so that it would wrap around the screw. Put her on tight. And same with the other one. And I'll explain what we're doing here. Okay, this this wire right here is coming in from the box. Oh, I'm 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 sorry. This this wire here at the bottom, this is the one that's coming in at, from the box. All right, I put that on one terminal. And then this other wire goes to the next outlet. So I put that on the other one, other screw. All right. Got a couple ground wires. Okay, now the next part of it, one thing I said before is that usually the white wires go on the silver screws. Over here on this side, you got two brass screws. So I'm going to loosen up both of these. And then we'll put the black wires on the brass screws. That's usually how it goes. All right. Take your This is the wire that goes that comes from the box. I think I'll put that on the bottom. Just bend your wire to about that position and then sort of maneuver it into place. Have your tools handy. I got a tool bag right here. You only see a little bit of it, I guess. That's sort of a close up on this uh, operation because I want you to uh, see what's going on better. And <laughs> I got the screw. Or I got the wire facing the wrong direction, so I'm going to have to bend it back the other way. <sighs> want this wire to go downward. Like that. Now it's in the right position to go around the screw. <clears throat> now that wire will interfere with the next one so I don't want that to happen so I gotta sort of hold it in place
All right, now, <clears throat> next wire, same way, you've got to bend it down, like that. Put it on your screw. Uh, this is a repetition of some of the earlier videos, uh, but <clears throat> repetition is the key to learning. And the more you practice at it, the better off you'll be. You don't have to um, be afraid to uh, work with uh, electricity. <clears throat> All right, this is a ground wire. This uh, screw right here has a little bit of green left on it. Uh, a lot of times they are green. I want this wire to go like that. There we go. Now this wire here, I'm going to um, fasten it onto the screw that's in the box. Okay, uh, what I did here is uh, I put a couple of cable clamps on this box. All right. And the way you put these on is I'll show you how to take it off. Two, take your pliers, hold your cable clamp like this. All right. And then take your screwdriver. Take your screwdriver and what I like to do is put these on the bench first but you push down right here on this uh, ring you have a ring like this okay And take your cable clamp, put it in the hole, take this ring, and it's got two sides to it. You have this side here, and then you have this side. Uh, this side here is the one that goes toward the cable clamp. So you put it in there, and then tighten up that ring, all right, tighten it up by hand, let me move my camera here so you can see it. Okay.
All right, you hold your cable clamp with your pliers and then tighten up that ring with your screwdriver. You might have to uh, hit it kind of hard with your hand. Tighten her up good. Alright, and then what I did was I'm going to mount this box like this with uh, this cable clamp at the top and this one over at the side. And I'm going to mount it on a post this way. So what I did was there's two holes on the side. I don't know if you can see these two holes here, right here, and I, I'm going to drive in screws at an angle, so I took my drill and I drilled two angular holes in there. Then I'm going to take screws and screw it into the place where I want it. Alright, well this box is going to be mounted right here. So I've got to uh, drill two pilot holes. I'm going to make it basically as high as the other one that's over here. So I drill a couple pilot holes. These screws are about an inch and a half, two inches, something like that. I'm going to uh, mount this plumb, so um, it's it's pretty close to plumb. And I uh, get one screw in, and uh, then go put the other one in. Drill them about inch and a half, two inches. And uh, make sure it's firm. That's pretty good. Then I'm going to take a, a wire from this box right here and run it over here to this box here because I'm going to put a switch on. A couple switches. Okay, what we're going to do here is uh, I'm going to take uh, this wire, these bunch of wires out of here, take it loose from this uh, outlet so that I can bring power over here. And then, uh, then I'm going to put the switches in so that I can change this and switch this off and on when I want to. That way I can have power out here in the barn. Um, that's the whole goal is to have power out here and then if I'm working on it I can switch it off and on here instead of at the box. But yet I will still have this outlet still hot 
So I'm not sure exactly how it's going to all work out. 